African village life. These are my morning, evening routine in my village in Kenya. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and watch this video till the end. Now we are in the kitchen. We finished making mandazis, now we are making chapatis. Chapatis are like, they are made from wheat flour, like all papas wheat flour and uh, two tablespoons of sugar and half, uh, half a teaspoon of salt. 
uh, this is good for like dinners. You can eat it with breakfast and all that. So you are a huge family. So we are making for everyone. My sisters, my brother, my brother's wife, my nephew and neighbors and visitors that may come. So I'm making that and it will be ready for dinner. We just decided to make it. So this is the trick to get soft, flaky, layered chapatis. Uh, I'll show you. So you roll. First you roll them into a bowl. Then you roll. And then you put... You see there I'm rolling. I think my sister does it better. My sister is the champion for making chapatis. I do try. I'm learning here as you can see. I'm always learning. I love to cook guys. I don't know if you know that. But I love cooking and trying new recipes. And improving my own like style of cooking. So we put oil... After you roll it flat, you put oil in the middle and then you you take the flour and dust it. After I've put oil, I'm going to show you. Oh, I didn't do that. Why did I not listen? Like guys, don't do as I do. Do as my sister is doing. <laughs> yes. Mama. Why Elizabeth, you don't have to go to Sako katubaya ya kilo moja ya mama? Yeah. Kilo moja? Steak. Stop. Ya steak? Stop. Ah, steak do poma ya mpupa. Steak. Ndiyo mkilongo. Si ndiyo. Si ndiyo. Ndiyo mama anaza pita ponyo mama azizi. Mataka kuenda wapi. Tufunge ya mlango jwa kazi. Ya na ingine, ya na ingine na kuta mpupa. Guys, this is a traditional vegetable it's seeds for managu. I don't know how it's managu called in English, but it's seeds for managu. Rinago. Atari. 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 
Lasting powder. Sinda. Ya kutwa the time it. Sinda. So mama is putting medicine for for the maize because we dread the maize now you have to put medicine to remove this eh? these bugs so you have to to cure your cure your maize to prevent or oh, to prevent not to <laughs> cure <laughs> now we buy your kitchen it looks like that, the dawa. Mm. 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 We are putting the maize, the cured maize, in this stock. This is our stock. I am a very strong and a good and broke at the end of I am a good one. 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 I am a to cook from mama especially the traditional like food african food from my tribe i learned it from my mama my mama taught me how to make ugali that's why i'm always with my mama because she teaches me how to take care of our home how to take care of my family how to like feed them nature them care for them and i'm always going back home because my mama lives in the village now I decided to live in Nairobi just to hustle and get the money. You see, she's now teaching me how to cook girl. She said like <laughs> So you see that's my mama teaching me how to cook. I'm going to do a like, voiceover and put some music on because the background noises were uh, people playing songs. And today we are cooking for our fundies also. Our fundies like the local other construction workers. <laughs> Mommy loves cooking for people. Like that's how she teaches me and like food is love food is home food is comfort and we love to to serve the people who serve us the best way uh, as you can see or if you don't follow my channel up to date is uh we are making our mother the outside not the outside you used to have the outside pit latrine but now we are making this way the fundies are here by the way the local constructors are here they are making we are making a toilet and bathroom inside the house it's a big achievement this house is very very old and when my mama wa, wa, was making it they were like teaching us like their children eight of us school through school they were putting us through school through university so they just did what they called at that time and we are very proud of what how they've come. We've always we're always upgrading our home, like making it comfortable for my mama because this is so like warm, heartwarming to see like we can do this for our mama and we want her to have the best life because she provided for us. Her and dad used to work like my mom was a secretary in Kenyatta University secretary to the vice chancellor in Kenyatta University so she's worked all her life and my dad was uh, uh used to work in the army 
like Kawa barracks or out. So yeah, those are the fundies. They took a break, so they're eating, they're eating really good. We're all eating. So yeah, when I go back to the village, I'll show you it's fully completely. The bathroom is fully complete. We'll show, I'll show it to you when I go back to the village. <laughs> So I was testing, I was testing my mama like uh, vegetable. It was so good, guys. You know why I was shocked? Because my mama, when I'm with my mama, my mama doesn't cook at all. Like I take the cooking. I love cooking for my family and the people I love and my friends. And UK type, when you come visit me, I'm going to be cooking for you. Okay, so yeah, it's just a good day. It's good vibes. And I'm so happy that... I'm here, I'm sharing my life with you guys. If you like this kind of video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That's Ugali and this is how you eat Ugali properly. You take, you roll, and then you take it, like you scoop it. And then after that, I put water for boiling so I can go and have a shower after a hard day. Our sister-in-law prepared this for New Year. Mm. Mm. Oh, mm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, mm. Me, I'm dressing Tony. Tony because I have flu. My husband is so sick of Cheers to me, Leah. I'm busy with the scissors, not on the